Welcome to another episode of Cooking on 350. I'm your host, Cook. I'm your host. So, tonight we have something special for you. We are actually going to do... We're going to do our version of fish tacos. Yeah. We're going to use a tilapia as well as shrimp. And, yeah, so let's go ahead and jump into it. Let's get started. No time to waste. I love fish tacos. So love some fish tacos. I really want to get these things done. So mm -mm. Okay, so what you're going to do, what we have here are four tilapia fillets as well as some shrimp. So we've already seasoned them with some of our favorite seasonings. Yes, and okay, so I use an Italian flair on it. So you can season your uh, fish however you like. But I kind of like to just, you know, have that seafood feel when I have fish anytime. So it's an Italian seafood. Hey. Ooh. <laughs> what the ooh? Anyway, so we're going to go ahead and All right, uh, we're gonna throw get... it in the oven. Right? Yes, and what are we going to put this oven to? What temperature are we going to put this oven on, guys? Who knows? Can you yell it for me? You. You. <laughs> you. I'm sorry, I can't hear you. No. Yes, yes. 350. No, 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 no. We literally want to hear you yelling because you're not yelling. You're watching. I want you to yell it out. I know someone's yelling it. What Jesse, temperature? I know you're yelling it. I know you're yelling it. Go ahead and tell them. 350 degrees. We're cooking on 350, people. Always. No All jokes right. here. So, we're going to get this in the oven for 350 degrees. And now, Vince is going to take over. Let's go, baby. So. When we cook fish tacos, we like to do something called making it classy. As you know, we love cheese. Now you know we love us cheese. And I ain't ashamed of it. I'm not. So tonight we're actually going to make our own cheese sauce. And yeah, I've already prepared a little bit of it. So, take this lid off here. Let's get started. Got my nicely cut cubes of Velveeta cheese. Drop it in my pot here, and I'm actually going to use a little bit of milk. You know, I'm just whatever just milk you like, two percent whole, whatever. We're not here to judge anybody, people. <laughs> but yeah, so we're going to use a little bit of cheese. I cut it into blocks; it's a little easier to melt down. Mm -hmm. And got a little bit of uh, chopped up tomato as well as pepper. So jalapeno pepper there. Probably gonna need about one full jalapeno pepper. We don't need too much cheese because we don't have that many tacos, to be honest with you. So, a little bit of milk, cheese. Portions, it's all about portions. Full jalapeno pepper. <laughs> Did I say cheese? I meant to say cheese. Lots of, well not lots of so, cheese, you know. <laughs> you, you can season it however you like. I use a little bit of brown pepper. We like spicy around here. Or you can use a garlic and pepper mix. So I'm using a little bit of garlic, a little ground pepper, and a little bit of onion powder. Just to get with that little... I don't know what that is, but I saw it on the TV and it sounded good. Yes. So y'all, y'all, y'all gotta feel me on that, right? We need to start watching, what is it, Chef Ramsay? Chef Ramsay. Chef Ramsay is I the people chef. Hey, holla at us, you know, but don't cuss me out, but... So, make sure you're stirring this. The cheese is gonna melt pretty fast, but you wanna make sure it's uh, distributed it. Yeah, I, I was about to make something else. But yeah, just uh, keep stirring it. You want your cheese to melt, but you don't want to just stick to the bottom of the pan. As always, of course, you know, we play our own little drinking game. Um, I don't know the rules. It's four shot, take a shot. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> rules don't get any simpler than that, people. Yes. But uh, as we let this stuff cook, Got the fish and shrimp baking right now. Got our cheese sauce going. Let's stir go. that again. We're gonna have to cut to a commercial break. So, but speaking of commercial breaks. Okay, so we would like to invite local designers, um, photographers, makeup artists, pretty much any stylists, anybody. If you want to send us any artwork or ads and we will feature them on the show, just, you know, we just like to have fun and help others out as well. So, yes, um, we will have our emails somewhere. Everyone already said below, so I got to say it. I don't know if it's going to be below. Yeah. Oh, Facebook is up. Oh. 
<laughs> yes, I think. We will somewhere have, on this somewhere screen. Somewhere on the screen. We will have um, our emails. So email us and we will, you know, look over everything. Make sure it's appropriate. Because, you know, we like the kids. So I found out that some of our little cousins watch our show, which is so awesome. Shout out to our viewers. We were actually in Chickasha today for my Aunt Charlotte's retirement party. Congratulations. Yay. Putting our hard work. I'm trying 44 to be like you. years. Man, Come I'm trying to now. be like you for real. So, we have some people that watch us and we love you all. So, absolutely. Yes, yeah, send us ads, our work, anything you would like us to feature on here and we will, you know, let everyone see the people that we know and Artistry 922. Never stop exploring. Be you. Be, you. Be, beautiful. Be beautiful. It's a beautiful, it's a beautiful thing. thing. Each and every one of us is a walking investment. Believe in yourself. Invest in yourself. Welcome back, guys. Hope you enjoyed the commercial break. So... While you were gone, we've been preparing a little bit more. Right now I got my broccoli boiling, uh, seasoned up. I just use a little bit of pepper. Don't need too many flavors combined here. Uh, I got a little bit of butter in there because some people like butter. I love butter. I really don't put more, but I'll take what he put in there. I love butter, what can I say? All right, so. Um, one thing we love to add to our fish uh, tacos is something a little bit different. We like to balance out the flavors. So, with all of the spiciness that we're adding, we are going to add pineapples. Alrighty. So, this is actually real pineapple. We uh, cut it up. <laughs> so, we got our pineapple, cut it up into little pineapple chunks. And we're actually going to... Uh, Pan sear. Pan sear, yeah. The pan sear <laughs> on our stove top here. Lika, I hope we're using the right terms. I'm sure we get it. A little bit section. right now. And correct everything we've done wrong. Yes, okay. That's okay. We appreciate it. We love it. We appreciate it. You know, we're just trying to learn. So I am going to, I'm using a pan sear. So I'm gonna pan sear the pineapple. You wanna get a little bit of a crunch to it, a little brown, just add some color. We are really going for the color. We like to see bright food. So with the green and the broccoli and the yellow and the pineapple, we're gonna have a pretty good summer dish. This is gonna be awesome, awesome, awesome for summer. Awesome possum. You already know. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, uh. Okay. And I actually, I think our tilapia is ready to come out. Tilapia and shrimp. Yes, we're gonna get that out the oven. Let's see, go ahead. So I'm gonna let this sit for a little bit. Let it get even on one side. Broccoli is looking good. So since we got our tilapia out, we're actually going to put our uh, tortillas in. You can use flour based, wheat based, whatever your diet consists of. And we're just going to put them right on the, the rack. Right on the rack. Try to get some grill marks if we can. Yes, we don't want it to be like super crunchy. Just a little bit of brown to it, a little crunch. A little crunch, but still foldable. Yes. You know? Make sure it folds, you know? Mm -hmm. Alrighty, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. Ooh, look at Lord. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. I guess you need to. <laughs> <laughs> yes, this is going to be awesome. So, we just love us some fish tacos. When did we really start making these? I don't know. We got this recipe down a couple years ago. Yeah, about a year or two ago. Yeah. So, while we're, we're going to cook a little bit and talk to you. Uh, so, next episode, we've actually got a way for you guys to get a little more involved with the show. We're actually going to have a little bit of trivia going on. We're going to go live. Yes. And we're going to put a challenge out there. 
so you guys can win some fun prizes, all right? Yes, and get to interact with us. We love, I mean, we love the interaction. It's fun. Yes. We enjoy this. As you know, we do this for the love of cooking and the love of each other. Yes. Count the brownie points. Hey. You know I just got some. No, y'all really don't. Y'all count the drinking up. game as well? Yeah, my brownie points might be a drinking game. Oh, but yeah. Right now, it's just a brownie points game. Just because... a brownie points. Just trying to... I love this side. Yes. Stay on the good side of your lady. Happy wife, happy life. Or as Ain't Sin would say, if you knew better, you do better. Come All on. right, shout out to Ain't Sin. You know. Come on. Shout out. So Pineapple know, is looking good. Looking good. Broccoli's just about starting to boil. Got our cheese sauce ready. We are almost ready to complete these fish tacos. So, I think we're actually going to cut to another short commercial break. Once again, send us your ads, commercials if you have them. Let we would love to feature you guys. Um, Below is our emails. Emails are popping up Facebook somewhere. Or somewhere. Yes, holla at us. Somewhere. <laughs> Anyways, cut the commercial break. We'll be right back. I'm going anywhere, all right? See you in a bit. Hey guys, how you doing? This is Nick here with Pimp with Nick Personal Sports Performance Training. Just want to let you guys know I have great rates. If you're looking for one-on-one -on -one personal training, if you're looking for a sport specific skill training, or if you're just looking for it just to get you. Plate our meal and enjoy. Yes. Okay. So if you could hand me those tacos. Alrighty. Yeah. So we have our flour tortilla shells, and Vince is going to put all the good stuff inside. So oh, what we have here. Start with it. Oh, that's a big piece. <laughs> nice big piece of tilapia there. Is a half a piece for each of the tacos. Boom. Mm -hmm. Putting approximately three shrimp in each of those right on top of that tilapia filet. Yes. Shrimp is really, really good. I, yes. I've already tried it. Yes, you seasoned it. I just had to make sure. To perfection. You know, I'm working on my seasoning. And Compliment to Le Chef. Hey. That's her. Cooks. All right. Put a little broccoli on top. We, use, we just used the uh, broccoli florets. Uh, we like the florets. What can we say? I do. Mm -hmm. All right. I love me some well seasoned uh, broccoli. Gotta be well seasoned yes, yes, or yes. it has that cheese on it. Look at we got both. <laughs> Adding pineapples. Yes, that is our secret ingredient. Ingredient. But shh. Don't tell nobody. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Look. We grilled those. They have a little brown on both sides. All right. And then the final, oh, almost final Greek. So we're actually going to do what we said, make it classy. Yes. Might be too far yet. Mm -hmm. Add a little bit of the melted queso we made ourselves. Yes. Really oh. spicy. We like a lot of spice and a lot of cheese. So we always go for a lot of sauce. We make it classy. Yeah, at this point, you guys know me pretty well. We've heard personal it's comments. <laughs> well enough to know that I like cheese. Yes. And I'm not going to lie. I love it, too. I'm not going to take all the blame. Oh! Yeah. All right, then we're going to add a personal favorite of sriracha. As you can see, as the bottle's almost empty, we love us some sriracha. Yes, we're going to drizzle that one really nicely. Okay, so let's try to show the plate without making tacos fall off. sour cream? Oh, yeah. Sour cream? How can I forget? If you like sour cream, add it. I love it. 
if you don't Let add it. <laughs> nah, just kidding, guys. Just because like the recipe it. says it. You gotta follow these recipes. Yes. Just kidding. So you have almost. We're just giving ideas for dinner night. Mm. Yes. Sour cream. Yes, that's um, mine. That's my stuff. Even make, it out. Make it a hard decision for you. Oh, me, no, it's still, I can tell. <laughs> Boom. Yes. So, don't know if you can see that. I'm not going to risk losing a taco. That is. So, you guys have officially made classy fish tacos with cooks yes. and drinks. Yay. Amazing, While right? cooking on 350. Isn't Boom. that amazing? Yes. We've held true to our name thus far. Yes. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. So, now, everyone, be on the lookout for us going live. And so you can all um, be included in our challenge. You'll have more details later on. But be on the lookout. You know, everyone, you know loves to see us make wonderful food but we also love to talk as you can see love to give back so we, <laughs> we have love great gifts yes great so, prizes oh yes wonderful prizes so be on the lookout for that so so guys you've enjoyed a wonderful night with us and vice versa we've enjoyed a wonderful night with you as always i mean from our kitchens or our kitchen our kitchen to your homes You've been cooking on 350. With Cooks. And Vince. We will love to see you all next time. Have a great night. We'll see you next time.